How to Toilet Train a Cat If you're tired of cleaning your cat's litter box every day, toilet training your cat might be a great option for you. Not only will it save you time and money on litter, but it will also be more environmentally friendly. However, toilet training a cat can be a challenging task, and it requires patience, persistence, and the right approach. In this article, we'll provide you with some tips on how to encourage your cat to use the toilet. 1. Start with a clean litter box. Before you begin toilet training your cat, make sure your cat's litter box is clean and in good condition. If your cat is used to using a litter box, they might not want to switch to a toilet if the litter box is dirty or in bad shape. Also, make sure to use a litter that is similar to the one you use in the litter box. 2. Transition to a litter-free box. Once your cat is comfortable using a clean litter box, you can start to transition to a litter-free box. A litter-free box is a shallow plastic tray or box that fits on your toilet seat. Place the litter-free box next to your cat's litter box and gradually move it closer to the toilet over time. Make sure to put some treats or a favorite toy in the litter-free box to encourage your cat to use it. 3. Raise the litter-free box. After your cat has adjusted to the litter-free box, you can raise it to the height of the toilet seat using a stack of books or a stool. This will help your cat get used to the new height and position of the litter-free box. 4. Replace the litter-free box with a training seat. Once your cat is comfortable using the litter-free box on top of the toilet, you can replace it with a training seat. A training seat is a plastic or metal seat with a hole in the middle that fits over your toilet seat. The hole should be large enough for your cat to comfortably use it. Some training seats come with a step stool that helps your cat get onto the seat. 5. Encourage your cat to use the training seat. At this point, you should start encouraging your cat to use the training seat instead of the litter-free box. You can do this by placing treats or a favorite toy on the seat, or by using a command word like, go potty, or, use the toilet. You might also want to use a clicker or a verbal marker to reward your cat when they use the training seat. 6. Gradually remove the training seat. Once your cat is using the training seat consistently, you can start to gradually remove it. You can do this by cutting a small hole in the middle of the training seat and gradually enlarging it over time. Eventually, your cat will be using the toilet seat directly. 7. Reward your cat. Throughout the toilet training process, it's important to reward your cat for using the toilet. This could be in the form of treats, praise, or playtime. Rewarding your cat will help reinforce the behavior and encourage them to continue using the toilet. 8. Be patient and persistent. Toilet training a cat can take time and patience, and there might be setbacks along the way. Some cats might take longer to adjust to the new routine than others. If your cat is having trouble using the toilet, you might need to go back a step or provide more encouragement and rewards. 9. Make sure your cat is comfortable. It's important to make sure your cat is comfortable using the toilet throughout the training process. Make sure the training seat or toilet seat is stable and secure, and that your cat can. 